Hello, my beautiful Capricorns! Welcome to your singles monthly reading. This is for the month of February. General energy loves. Take it accordingly. My highly resonate with you. My be here and there a message. As well, for those of you who've been asking about giving you more messages regards finances, if this reading is not you know affiliated with any finances definitely will look into and for those of you who ask about health you know no medical advice or you know work related no legal advice will get certain insights from spirit probably what you take care of more or probably what you should pay attention more but again this is not legal neither medical advice all right loves all right capricorns let's see single capricorns we do have here six of wands king of pentacles five of pentacles queen of wands ten of wands nine of pentacles and ace of swords okay so there is a dispute here between you and someone why is telling me here that someone here got the got the recognition and the other one didn't got anything somebody here feels like you know they work for whatever it is and you could take the the recognition or the um, the price But it seems here some something here is not quite or somebody here didn't even thought will be as big mm -hmm. yes let's see what this is about for some of you this could be an issue work related or business related but somebody here take recognition for what not done or what they did not done will do high priestess it's kind of the truth will come out hangman but now it's still luck and two of pentacles so if you are thinking here of something definitely your intuition is telling you what to do queen of pentacles four of pentacles but yes this is something here that someone doesn't want to do two of pentacles four of pentacles queen and the king of pentacles and the hangman for some of you capricorn you might deal here with um, with someone who is committed i have a leo energy here for some of you it's a Leo, for others of you it's a Pisces, could be another earth sign, but something here someone doesn't want to do it, it's like no way, I'm not going to do it, why someone here is, it's not like threatening, but it's like I will say the truth, what's the hangman here for, seven of swords, yeah somebody here is try to work certain things out which not quite prince of swords queen of swords yes someone here is not quite or will not gonna be pretty happy yeah look at the swords nine of cups oh wow It's like as much as someone here resists here, they will get what's theirs. Two of Pentacles. Two of Wands. It's kind of sooner or later a decision needs to be made. Okay. Princess of Wands.
King of Swords. And the Alchemist, this is the, um, the Magician. Somebody here definitely thought that they will work it through. You know what? Somebody here suspect something. That's, that's the right word here. Speaking of emotionally or personally, okay, Capricorn. Somebody here is keeping an eye on someone. Doesn't do much in the moment and probably didn't do for a while, but they suspect things, okay? But they are not willing to, to go. Four of Pentacles, Four of Cups, Two of Cups. Somebody here can't let go the family, cannot let go the, the love of their life. That's what I'm hearing. But they are super upset. kind of they try to to keep it cool but they are super upset was the, um, the high priestess here for seven of wands three of swords yeah somebody here does know we have a lot of pages it's kind of people talk death for some of you it's you who don't want to resist and want to end this connection this on and on and on and on situation three of cups what's the queen of wands the queen of pentacles here for nine of wands yeah we have all the nines here loves which really speaks here, a situation here, it's over. And this situation could be the third party. It's like whoever this person you were dealing, they, they are they are spouse or they are person know about, they, they might not know about you, but know that they are being cheated on. But they resist to move on from this. It seems here that they, they may even say, this is my, my fate. This is my life. This is my fate. That's how it is. Judgment, yes. It seems here that this person it's, is living kind of the... Life after life, the same life, kind of. For some of you, Capricorn, you might deal here with someone very, very successful. Don't get me wrong. But it's kind of like you, you are much smarter than them. Why you stumble across them? Let's see here. Why, why did you stumble across them in the first place? Five of Swords, you fall for their lies, or they could be a charmer. Absolutely, Six of Wands, and it's like I'm, I'm, I'm picking up a smell. I don't know what's the smell, but it's such a um, come to me smell situation. I don't know if that is even the the name, but it, it's like they are smell. It's so, so attractive. Let's see here, what else? Prince of Cups. Oh, they, they offer you certain things here. But that was only lies. It's kind of till they catch you. Chariot. The, the moon in uh, Cancerian that could be at the end of the year or in the middle of the year 
eight of pentacles you could meet them through work or at work or you could work with them but something here worked for a little while what about now king of cups definitely a very manipulative energy here king of wands six of swords Prince of Wands, Six of Pentacles. There's something here, work-related energy. That it's kind of two of you cannot be in that. Or cannot be on the same level. And that's why you you might have been taking the new new beginning here. Yes. Or you start something new. Or you left whatever is here. Where are you hitting? It's a new beginning. You are moving to the, towards the sun. If there are anyone around you, or you're hitting towards anyone, or towards anything. Eight of Swords. The Empress. Five of Wands. You know, they are the people, but I don't feel you see them. Yeah, neither is it's kind of neither see them, neither let them in. There's something here like big happen, could be professionally, that they kind of threw you off. And that's kind of a thing here. You, It's like, I don't want to see anyone and I don't want to go towards anyone. Whoever is this person, now you know the snake. And the snake first bite, the next time they will eat you. All right, let's see here, health-wise. Health-wise loves. It's kind of you, before we go to the health, speaking about the, the finances, you are gonna recover. And what's yours will be given, but a little harder. It's kind of you got to prove yourself that that was you. I don't know what that means to, but whatever here you worked for. Okay. Health-wise, what's going on here, loves? We have the Hierophant. We have the Tower. We have the Devil. Wow. And we have the Hermit. Okay, and Four of Swords. Health-wise, take a rest and don't do anything stupid. Because I feel here someone might found themselves in a hospital. And, I don't know, anxiety or madness where you get upset and get out of your mind or something here because it seems here that for some of you 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 know sometimes people get upset so bad that they have a huge headache that doesn't go for days so pay attention to the headaches for others of you here be careful why you or be careful to not get upset because you might end up with um, how you how you gonna say the um, hypertension or your tension will will raise will not be normal. I feel here whatever there's a there's an incident here. It's like some madness here. I'm I'm picking up. Only for whoever resonates, and again, this is not medical advice, but having four major arcanas, this really speaks of take care of your health. Don't play with your health. Whatever here, you know, either get upset or do something here, would you? Don't. Okay? Star. Things will improve healing will come here it's kind of a nervous um, meltdown situation here could be for some of you 
but again somebody again another card of uh, major arcanas this is a uh, this this could be the time between um, new moon in uh, Aquarius and full moon in um, in Virgo, which new moon is on February 9th and February 24 is the full moon in in the Virgo, okay? Aquarius and Virgo. So be very careful, especially this this time frames from 9 to the 24. I feel here this is more about either your company or whatever here you worked on. It's very, very related to work, not as much love. But I feel here someone here indeed, indeed lead you to a situation that is no way but them to win. I hope that makes sense. You know... They will take their karma back. Don't worry about it. Somebody here is very upset. But again, health-wise, be careful. Don't do anything or don't get upset because money come and go. But your health might not. And for some of you, yes, you could have a nervous meltdown or, um, or you literally can do something. Don't do anything. When it's coming that madness or craziness, go out in the nature or go in the public or see people and, and so on. But I see here a night or a evening. It's very significant this month. Okay. What advice we have for you, darlings? Princess of Cups. It's kind of you... If you could do one time, the next time you'll do better. Because there is something new here coming in. But it seems here you, you don't need it or you're not looking for it. There is some stubbornness here as well. Ten of Cups. So Spirit says... Give yourself um, a break. Give yourself a chance to see what's around you. Because some, um, for some of you, you may feel here this, whoever comes here or whatever comes, doesn't matter. Or it's insignificant. Or you can't see it now. Or you are not in the place. You know, sometimes a good friend goes for the long run. Okay, because there is someone here, you might not understand why they stick around you. It's for the reason because they want to be that supporter, that person whom you definitely need around you. So there is a person here like an angel around you. Don't ignore them, okay? Because for you, yes, there are certain things here in your life that are kind of fill up your cup, but not in a good way. So take care of that, loves. All right, Capricorn, goodness. Love and light, loves. Thank you for watching. I hope this resonates. If it does, let us know. Bye for now.